Hey everybody, Ernie Hatmaker here, and I'm on the porch today, um, dealing with a few seedlings, trying to decide what's going to go in the ground and, you know, who's going to stay on the porch a little longer to harden off. So, let's see what I got. This was um, the Cubanelle pepper. It has flowers on it. There's a few burn spots from um, where it got a little too close to the heat lamp. And, I mean, not heat lamp. Lord have mercy. <laughs> the, the grow lights. Um, I don't have a heat lamp. But um, other than, you know, a few crispy marks on the leaves, which I might pull off before I plant, um, it's doing pretty well. But I can see that roots are starting to come up down there um anyway over here i've got a couple of um they were called slicer tomatoes um i don't really know what they are um i bought the seeds off select seeds and thought i'd try them um these down here in the the peat pots are arkansas travelers i've got a lot more of those these are the remainders of what uh i have left of butternut squash that i have not planted yet um, you can see right there, that little uh, area. They got a little watered out at first. Um, as I was, you know, they pretty much got left out here during a bunch of storms while they were hardening off. And that's just kind of what happened. Um, that one's kind of weird. Some of these haven't come up yet. And they look like they want to. Um, and then I have some sunflowers, which all my labels got blown off in the storm. So, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what they are. Their labels are just kind of all over the place. But I've planted um, three types of sunflowers. They're all large, but yeah, I don't know what's what anymore. And then over here is the remainder of my cabbage, which I haven't planted yet. And this here is another um, tomato. It's a a beef master. 